Hey guys, it's me, Timeless Engines, back here with another video. And today, I will be reviewing, yes, a review in the box. Uh, come on. Thomas, you can do it. That's a little hint right there. Okay, Tom, come on, Thomas. The motorized, oh god, okay, um, the motorized Thomas, Annie, and Clarabelle three pack. Uh, Thomas, you can just take your troublesome trucks away. Um, okay, now that they're gone, Thomas will stay here for a part of the video. Um, this is a really big deal for me. Uh, and this is, this is very cool. I got this at Walmart today for ten eighty eight. Um, at my local Walmart. So, if you want to get a good price, go there. Uh, it, this video is not sponsored by them. Yeah, um. So, anyway, this is in the new motorized packaging. Um, you guys have already seen on many other people's videos what these look like, so I'm just going to do a brief overview of it. We've got Thomas, Thomas and Friends, Fisher Price, motorized, with a Thomas with electric thing in it. Thomas and Clarabelle, 3 plus. Top. Uh, Thomas and Clarabelle, motorized, Thomas and Friends. Pergsank, near, and Emily. Uh, legal jargon. Um, uh, oh, okay. I will go slow on this part. Thomas going up that barcode right there. That is so cool. They also had Kenji, Duchess, and I think I'm the first one to find this. They had the the Trackmaster Golden Thomas for the 75th anniversary. They had it in the new motorized packaging. So I think I'm the first one to find that, and it's still at the 75th logo, so that's cool. I think I'm the first one. I didn't take any pictures or anything because I didn't have my device on me, but yeah. I'm super, and I went to a different Walmart this time. My local, like my local, local Walmart didn't even have a Thomas section, while the one we went to, that was in a completely different city, um, actually had a really good Thomas selection, so... I already kind of opened this up. Like, I didn't actually fully get out of the box. Like, I didn't feel them or anything. I tried, but I decided to wait for the video, so. Never done, like, this on camera before, so. So, let's take a look at this pamphlet. Let me set this down real quick. Okay, so, uh, let me get this pamphlet open. Okay, so I thought there would be something more interesting here, like a catalog or something. It's so literally just how to put batteries inside of them, which I've literally never read these, even with the Trackmaster stuff. So now that we've got this out of the box, uh, I've got my scissors are on the table. Uh, I guess this would be a good way to see my cat as well. Hi, cat. Just need to grab the scissors real quick. Okay. Um, actually, I might not need scissors. Let me set this down. Okay, so it turns out scissors aren't everything in life. Um, okay. To try and open this as best as I can on camera. Put my leg on it to open it. There we go. There we go. Um, you can go over there too. All right. Finally, my favorite part. Okay, so let's start with the basics. Um, Eddie and Clarabelle, you can wait while I take a look at Thomas real quick. So this is the new um, 2020 Thomas. He feels very light because there's no batteries in him yet. And, um, yeah, he's got very shiny axles. Probably the shiniest I've ever seen on a motorized model. So, these were also sold as, like, Trackmaster ones, and I never actually got a regular version of this style of Thomas, because, of course, like, in 2014, 2015, they had the older style of the Trackmaster Thomas with kind of the rubbery smoke box, like it was a rubbery plastic, and then they switched to just regular plastic, which I prefer, with this um, new face, which looks way better, and now in 2020... They got the eye reflections, so that's very cool. Compare them to the 2006 Thomas I have right here. This one just got newly printed decals, so. 
yeah. Definitely more quality put into this one. Just put some black buffer buffers and I think we might be on to something. Oh god, now the cat's playing with the box. What do you want from that thing? Anyway, uh, he better not be eating the tape. Okay, kitty, if you're gonna play with the box, do it over here, not there. Or else you get whacked in the face by a door. Anyway, alright, so let's take a look at the best part. Annie and Clarabelle. So, let's take a look at Annie first. So they've got 3D molded faces, surprisingly. Actually, not surprisingly, with the motorized line. Down here they say 2019. So these were made in 2019. So they had this idea way back, probably like more than a year ago. So yeah, they don't get produced till now though, because they got they gotta make millions of these for millions of children and probably a billion of them actually. Because there's like 7 billion people on planet Earth. Yeah. Okay, so you got actual windows with seats inside. Uh, camera focus. Okay. But yeah, if you can look closely, they have seats on the inside. Which is very cool. I saw somebody made a light up version of this. I personally won't be doing that because it just kind of, I don't know, I, I, like, I want to keep the seats in there. Yeah. Annie, Annie, gray roof, and then flat back. And it's got that new style of coupling. Um, I know people aren't too fond of it, but I'm, I'm fine with it. Like, I prefer the old one, but it doesn't bother me. So, yeah. It's got these weird geared wheels. I think they have them because when they're going up slopes, like, the, the cargo will kind of, like, slip back. And if they have geared ones, then they might have a bit better grip and they won't slip back. And it actually helps the engine a bit. Or they're just being lazy and reusing the wheels from that right there. Anywho. Um, yeah, looks pretty good. Now it's time for Clary Bell. Well, it's pretty much the same as that, except its face is on the back now. But yeah, this is originally on my Christmas list, but we checked the Thomas section, and I was choosing between Kenji and Thomas, because they're the only ones that were on my Christmas list that I really wanted, and I chose Thomas in the end, because, yeah... And I think I'll be not customizing this Thomas, actually. I, I probably will end up, actually, but as of right now, my mindset is to have the 2006 version and the 2020 version. Alright, now that we've taken a look at Annie and Clarabelle, let's couple them up to... Well, this guy doesn't have batteries, so we'll just use Tommy Thomas, or 2006 Thomas. I'm not sure if that's Tommy era, but we get these coupled real quick. Off camera, and there we go. Yeah, let's get the going. Ha <laughs> ha. All right, so they might need a bit of help. So this is also kind of a layout tour. Go over here. Oh, that looks so cool. Going past Cranky. I won't be using this Cranky on my next layout at my new house. I promise. That cranky sucks. Um, so, over here, he's having a bit of trouble on the hill. Let me give him a bit of a push with my foot. Alright, he's going under the bridges in the narrow gauge area. Um, Thomas Piggy Bank. <laughs> and now we're back in the yard where we started. Stop you right there, Thomas. Yeah, that was, that was pretty cool. My only suggestion for improvement aren't actually on Annie and Clarabelle. It's on Thomas. Give him some red black buffers. Not red, please no. Um and yeah, they look pretty good. Um so that's the Thomas Annie and Clarabelle pack, everyone. Uh let me think if there's anything else to say. Um not sure. Yeah, I think that's it. 
Um, so I'll see you guys in the next video. Um, yeah, Thomas, Annie, and Clarabelle. This is my first motorized product that I bought, and I plan on buying many more in the future. So, just tune in for that whenever that happens, which will.